Hello guys and welcome back to TechWolf and to another CompTIA A Plus Core 2 quiz. And this quiz will be 25 questions long. And if you would like to support the channel, click the button join, which is next to the subscribe button under this video. And now, no further ado, let's get into it. What is the name of an operating system installation type that preserves the system settings, personal files, and applications from the older operating system version. Clean install, image deployment, unattended installation, or in-place upgrade. And the correct answer here is in-place upgrade. Which of the following replaced removable media used for reformatting storage drives and restoring an operating system to the original factory condition? System partition, primary partition, recovery partition, or extended partition? And here the correct answer is recovery partition. A type of Windows installation that releases the entire contents of a target partition is called refresh, in-place upgrade, clean install, or repair installation. And the correct answer here is clean install. Which of the installation types listed below provides a simpler and less costly alternative to manual operating system installation in an environment consisting of multiple hosts requiring the same configuration settings? Remote network installation, in-place upgrade, unattended installation or image deployment? The correct answer here is image deployment. Windows Repair Installation, here we need to select the three answers, removes user applications, removes user files, does not affect the user applications, does not affect user files, preserves application configuration settings, or modifies application configuration settings. So what is related to Windows Repair Installation? And here the correct answers are does not affect the user applications, preserves application configuration settings, and also does not affect user files. Which of the following enable installation of an operating system via network interface? Select two answers. GPT, Disk Part, Netboot, GP Update, or PXC. So which one of these can be used to install or perform installation over the network? And here the correct answers are NetBoot and PXE. Devices that are not detected during the operating system installation process might require loading alternative third-party drivers. This statement is true or false? And yes, this statement is true. Which of the sources listed below allow for obtaining, installing and updating device drivers used by Microsoft Windows operating systems? Select three answers. Windows Device Manager Utility, Device Manufacturer, Computer Management Utility, Windows Update or Microsoft Store. And here the correct answers are Device Manufacturer, Windows Device Manager Utility and Windows Update are the correct answers. What are the advantages of organizing storage drive space into multiple partitions? Select three answers. Why we would want to create multiple partitions on our computers or on workstation? What are the main advantages? And here we also need to select three answers. Increase the overall disk storage space available for user data. Separated disk space used for virtual memory, multi boot environment, preventative measure against drive failures, se or separation of user files from the operating system and application files. So, which are the three benefits of creating partitions on your computer? And here the correct answers are separated disk space used for virtual memory, multi boot environment, and separation of user files from the operating system and application files. These are the three correct answers. Which of the following answers refers to a unique string of characters used in identifying hardware, software, and data? 
URI, OUI, OID or GUID. So which of the following answers refers to a unique string of characters used to identify hardware, software and data? And the correct answer here is GUID. Which of the answers listed below describes the characteristics of the MBR partition style? So there is GPT and MBR partition styles which you need to know about for your CompTIA Plus Core 2 exam. And this question is asking what are characteristics of MBR partition style? Support for disks larger than 2 terabyte, maximum disk size limit of 2 terabyte, legacy BIOS, overall number of partitions limited to 4, UEFI BIOS and up to 28 primary partitions. And here the correct answer is, it is a legacy BIOS, so this is the oldest version of BIOS, maximum disk size limit is up to 2 terabytes, and overall number of partitions is limited to 4. Which of the following answers refer to GPT? Up to 128 primary partitions, maximum disk size limit of 2 terabyte, legacy BIOS, support for disk larger than 2 terabyte, overall number of partitions limited to 4, and UEFI BIOS. And here we also need to select 3 answers. And here the correct answer is up to 128 primary partitions, support for disks larger than 2 terabytes, and UEFI BIOS are the correct answers. In GPT disk architecture, each partition is labeled with a unique identifier known as GUID. Is it true or false? And yes, this is true answer. Quick format. Here we need to select, in regards to quick format, three answers. Erase is all data to prevent its recovery. Does not check the drive for bad sectors. Requires more time than full format. Requires less time than full format. Does not erase data. And checks the drive for bad sectors. And the correct answers here are, does not check the drive for bad sectors, as when you are performing quick format, it is not checking the drive for bad sectors. And it requires less time than full format, as quick format is being executed much faster than full format, and does not erase data. So quick format also does not erase any data. Full format. And here we also need to select three answers. And here is exactly the same type of question, only what full format is doing or how it is different from quick format. Requires more time than quick format. Checks the drive for bad sectors. Requires less time than quick format. Erases all data to prevent its recovery. Does not erase data. Does not check the drive for bad sectors. And here the correct answers are, requires more time than quick format, checks the drive for bad sectors, and also erases all data to prevent its recovery. A list of computer hardware proven to be compatible with particular operating system is referred to as AJL, PRL, HCL, or CRL. And the correct answer here is HCL, which stands for Hardware Compatibility List. Which of the answers listed below refers to a file extension used in macOS for a file that contains an exact copy of a content of a storage device? .pkg, .pfx, .dmg or .app? And here the correct answer is .dmg. Which of the following answers refers to the macOS application installer file? So, which is the extension of application installer file, whether it's .pkg, .exe, .dmg, or .app, or app? And the correct answer here is .pkg. Which location in macOS provides access to application updates menu? App Store? Explorer, Spotlight, or iCloud. 
So which location in macOS provides access to application updates menu? So where would you go to update applications in macOS? And here's the correct answer is App Store. And here we need to answer whether it's true or false. An application in macOS can be executed by double-clicking on an icon with .app file extension. The icon with .app file extension also points to a directory, aka application bundle, that contains all the files necessary to run the application. Contents of the directory can be examined by right-clicking on the application's icon and selecting Show Package Contents from the Context menu. The process of uninstalling macOS applications that stores all files in one place is simplified and relies on moving the program icon to the system recycle bin called Trash. Is it false or true? And here the correct answer is this is true. As all you need to do if you would want to move the application or delete application in macOS is to move it to trash and it will be deleted. Which of the answers listed below refers to an SSO solution for all Apple's products and services? Sign in with Apple. This, and SSO, for those who does know, this is single sign-on. This means, and this is also what you need to know, SSO shortcut, which stands for single sign-on. Which of the answers listed below refers to a single sign-on solution for Apple's products and services? Sign-in with Apple, Secure Enclave, Apple ID, or Gatekeeper? And here the correct answer is Apple ID. And this question needs to be answered with true or false. Managed Apple ID is an account management solution that allows system administrators to disable certain features of Apple devices used by employees in a business environment. Is it true or false? And here the correct answer is that this is true. Which of the following macOS features allows to create switchable desktop environments? Aero, Spaces, Personalization, or Display? And here the correct answer is Spaces. Time Machine is built in Backup Utility for Windows, Linux, macOS, and other. And here the correct answer is that Time Machine is built in Backup Utility for macOS. A macOS system feature providing single screen thumbnail preview of all open windows and applications is known as Mission Control, Spotlight, Desktop Window Manager or Screen Sharing. And the correct answer here is Mission Control. And there you have it, another CompTIA Plus Core 2 quiz and if you are interested in more quizzes, find the link to all quizzes in the first pinned comment of this video and if you would like to support the channel, you can do so by clicking in join button next to the subscribe button under this video. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.